President Bola Tinubu has vowed not to pay ransom to kidnappers of scores of students and other people in parts of Nigeria, an official has said. Information Minister Mohamed Idris, who stated this in Abuja while addressing journalists on Wednesday, said the president also directed security agencies to ensure the release of all kidnapped victims without the payment of ransom. The minister's comments follow the mass kidnappings that have occurred in some states in Nigeria. In Kaduna, northwest Nigeria, over 200 students were kidnapped last week by yet-to-be-identified bandits. The Kaduna kidnap occurred a few days after about 400 people were kidnapped by Boko Haram insurgents in Borno. It's true that uh, uh, some of these are, are happening. We have seen what has happened in, uh, in Kaduna, in Maiduguri, uh, in Borno, rather, and then in Sokoto. Mr. President has said that this is an unacceptable situation. Um, he's not going to, uh, the government will not condone uh, abductions or kidnappings or any kind of uh, criminality in that direction. We're seeing, of course, this happen, and government is taking very proactive steps, first to mitigate that and also to stop the spread of uh, the, this, this apparent, you know, we are seeing some kind of uh, uh, movement by, the, the more the security agencies are also hitting these targets, uh, the, the targets of criminals, the more they are, they are pushed to also getting some uh, soft targets. But government is not taking any excuses. The, the president has directed that security agencies must, as a matter of urgency, ensure that these children and all those who have been kidnapped are brought back to, in safety and also in the process to ensure that not a dime is paid for uh, uh, ransom. So it's important to underscore that. No dime, government is not paying anybody any, any dime, and the government is optimistic that um, these children and other people that are abducted will be brought back to their families in safety.